Hi there, Kermit the Frog here. You're about to watch a video by Autobot Martin. Yeah! Hey guys, it's Autobot 410 back from another long hiatus. Wow, it's been a long time. Basically, I just want to come there and put like another video up. I got a couple of suggestions from you know a lot of good friends of mine, including my friend uh, Angie or uh, Cinnabon, as everyone would know her. Basically, I'm gonna look another story of um, my mini. Adventures with both of the women I know. As everyone would know, I'm very, very nervous around women, anyone that could tell from all my previous videos. And uh, this is actually going to be um, another video about every about a girl that everyone saw in one of my late and one of my earlier videos, uh, Cammy. That's right, it's another moment with Cammy. Wow, and there's a lot of them. This takes place actually a couple of months earlier before the first date I had with her. Like I said, we were very, very close friends to the point where I knew things that her past boyfriends didn't know, that her current boyfriends don't know. I mean, I knew things about this girl that would make most women blush. Uh -huh. Stop it. One of the places that me and my buddy used to hang out when I was back in college was outside of the uh, Chabot College Theater Department. There was like this one little area that was made a designated smoking area, but no one really used it for a smoking area except no one that smoked. One day, me and her were sitting there, and uh, one of the things that me and her used to do because she really trusted me is that she would sit on my lap. Any nice guy worth his salt has had a girl sit on his lap. Here's the reason why. Most women choose not to sit on the guy's lap because most guys will try and take advantage of the situation. Us nice guys don't. So basically a girl can literally sit on our laps because they know we won't do anything. Doesn't mean we're not thinking about it. <laughs> Anywho, um, she's sitting on my lap. We're there with like about 12 or 15 of her friends and um, we're sitting there having a good on conversation. I mean she's literally like right on top of me and my you know arms around her waist. I'm not overstepping my boundaries. And uh, people start walking by and start looking at us and giggling. Mm, this gets my attention. Tell her, okay, stay right where you are. I get up and I walk over. I look back from the distance where these people were staring and looking at us. I notice something very, very peculiar. Oh! Oh and behold, Cammy showed up wearing very, very tight clothes that day. So it was showing off her curves. I'm not sure if she was going to a workout later or if she went to a workout earlier. I don't know. I didn't ask. But she is, uh... Showing camel toe. And anyone who doesn't know what camel toe is, look it up. So I noticed this, and it's probably the closest I've ever seen to her panouche anyway, so I stood there for like a little couple of seconds just to enjoy it just a little bit, seeing how I probably never see it in real life. Sucks to be me. I walk up to her and I tell her, uh, sweetie, um, uh, I lean over and I whisper in her ear, I spy camel toe. And she looks back at me and she literally goes, well, what's camel toe? No fucking way, dude. So imagine trying to be the nice guy in my position, trying to explain to a girl you're attracted to, a girl that you know, and explain to her what camel toe is without sounding like a total white trash perv or a total fucking douche. Not an easy thing to do. Not easy. So I walk up to her and I finally start running through all the scenarios of how this could go well or how this could go bad. Uh. You know the, the, uh, and this, uh, no, uh, it, it's, fuck, it's, you know, you're, huh, and it's just facepalm all over again, it's driving me nuts. Finally, I just go out there and I just blankly try to, like, maneuver it in there. I know that, uh, that little crease down there, your, your clothes are kind of tight, it's kind of, she's giving it kind of an outline and that's what camel toe is, you know. It takes her a couple of seconds because like I said in my earlier video, she is more naive than I am. As soon as it kind of clicked, you saw, you know, just her face just go, oh! like, yeah. Oh my god, they saw that? I'm like, she jumps up, grabs my jacket, literally off my back, sits down and puts it over. I'm like, uh, that's not what it was made for, but okay. So that was a very interesting moment with uh, Cammy, and to this day, uh, she hasn't forgotten it. And um, according to what she told me, it's uh, one of the moments where she realized that, uh, where she really, really thought that I was completely gay because I wasn't just sitting there staring. We go on from there and uh, basically she never wore a, a tight outfit like that ever again. 
Uh, it, it was just a very funny moment. I just like to put it out there. I have like a whole lot of these funny stories, so I may start making more videos about that. Um, also, I'm also going to be making some more videos, uh, gaming videos of the uh, now released Medal of Honor uh, Warfighter. I'm hoping to get that on Friday, since today is Wednesday. And I'm also going to do a lot more videos of some of my uh, life stories when it comes to uh, women. And trust me, they're kind of funny. You guys might like them. Uh, and basically, that's really all I have to say about now. So uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Till all are one.